downtown's grocery store scene is about to heat up. This morning, our Matt McCutcheon is live taking a closer look at why that is and what's about to change. Good morning. Good morning, Julia. Soon, downtown Minneapolis will have three grocery stores. The oldest and longest running has technically been there for three months. Right here is where the newest will be. As you can see, still a long ways off before this opens. This is expected to be the Whole Foods here in downtown Indianapolis and is expected to open coming up in a couple of months. However, when you look at the overall numbers for downtown Indianapolis, you get a better idea of why there will soon be so many options here downtown. There are 30,000 people who call downtown home. That number only expected to go up with more than half a dozen apartment and condo projects under construction right now. In addition to that, 150,000 and people work downtown every day and stop for groceries on the way home and also stop for lunch and dinner grab and go options. Now, when it comes to the Whole Foods here in downtown Indianapolis, we know that they will have a 40,000 square foot store that will open in the 28 story. 360 Market Square Tower Complex right here on the first floor. Now, on Twitter, they say they will open in the spring of 2018. However, when I reached out to a company spokesperson, they would only say, quote, we're excited to open in Indianapolis. So pretty vague there to say the least about when they will open, how many people will work here, and when they will begin hiring. But a live look here at the store this morning, you can see still several months off from the store opening here in downtown. But today, another grocery store will actually open. We're going to take you on an inside tour of that store coming up a little later. And in our next half hour, we're going to break down all new information you will only see on Sunrise about the future of the downtown Needler's grocery store as well. So a lot to talk about here on this Thursday morning, Julia. All right. Thanks. Yeah, a lot of